A friend told me my father fell for this. Within about 40 seconds of sending his credit card into the form, they had run three charges for various amounts in the range of $4,000. He is a man of means, and large transactions are not unusual on his credit cards. So they all went through. He got his money back of course, but it was very very quick, from clicking submit on the form, to walking downstairs and asking his wife if she was expecting any packages, to the charges. It's a scam. There is no package so I don't think reporting it would be anything but a waste of time. These are sent out by the thousands. Just block and report as spam. Don't bother replying. Now they know your number is active. You will never get an email from anywhere other than USPS.com. Those two extra letters BP obviously fake, as you've already made clear you understand. They are outside of the reach of the USPS. Hence the reason they do it from there. They will get raided by the local authorities eventually, and they will open up shop somewhere else. I hate to say it but that's our world now. It's one of the very few good things that might come out of the upcoming digital IDs that most governments want to go with by 2030. The UN came up with the idea originally, they're trying to get pretty much every country to go with them. The upside is crime will be lower, no more child trafficking, or any person trafficking, due to all funds being digital, eventually, no more international drug dealing at They will control you and follow your every move, every single money transfer no matter how big or how small will be tracked and you will pay taxes. Are you one of those people who likes to sell a few things on eBay? Or on Facebook Marketplace? Expect to pay taxes for every single dollar you spend and receive. Even in the US freedom and privacy will be a thing of the past. Please everyone, do not see digital IDs as a plus because they are not. I don't care how much crime they stop. The fact that we will have no privacy anymore is a big enough downside to make it something I will not even consider participating in. Even if they require it. This is not a theory. It's not some crazy paranoia. It's coming and it's coming sooner than most people in denial believe. Beware and thank you for watching.